little quick addition here at the beginning of the video. Uh, I've been getting a lot of support here recently. I really appreciate everybody who's been liking videos, subscribing to the channel. It helps me a ton. I've moved up in the algorithm thanks to all the support that I've been getting from you guys. Thank you so much. Do enjoy the video if you're new here. If you like the video, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Again, it really helps me on the algorithm. I appreciate all of you greatly. What's going on everybody? My name is Dan. Welcome back to the Forge and Dan YouTube channel. As you can tell by probably the condition of where we are and how I look, uh, everything got canceled for this weekend. Jackson got canceled. Uh, Arlington's postponed their test in tune to next weekend. So today it'll just be kind of getting some little things done and uh, we're gonna bump the car off, get it warmed up, you know, get it a nice 15, 20 minute, you know, idle session and uh, change oil and everything. But get it ready for next week. Quick little disclaimer here about this GoPro footage. Uh, I've gotten some comments on this in the past. My head is gonna look like it's very high in the car. I promise we have three inches of clearance. I appreciate everybody's worry and support in this, but I promise we've got clearance. This was something we struggled with in the winter, but we inevitably got it. So thank you for the comments, but I promise we have clearance. Everybody get up, it's time to slam now. Let's go.
watching those GoPro clips. Got the car bumped off, warmed up. Um, now we're gonna change the oil on this thing. Get that ready for uh, this weekend. Another dark video in the trailer. Uh, I don't have the lights on right now, but I'm um, just kind of getting some stuff put away here, put in the trailer, getting ready to uh, go racing here, uh, hopefully sometime in the next couple of weeks. Um, this stuff is all gonna get hung up in here. I gotta put a bar in there and I'll hang up every, everything in there, but uh, we gotta kind of clean some of this stuff out here. We got tires and random stuff kind of spewed about, but uh, we're hopefully gonna pull this thing out and get her set up. Um, and then uh, we'll kind of be one step closer. So there you go. So as I said at the beginning of the video, um, Jackson canceled, Arlington postponed. Um, I'm hoping and praying that next weekend is gonna be that weekend where the weather breaks. Uh, according to the National Weather Service and the Farmer's Almanac and everything else you could possibly look at in terms of weather. Next weekend is that weekend to break. So um, not sure what we're going to do. Test and tune for Arlington is next weekend. Cedar Lake also has their open wing spectacular. Uh, the spring spectacular. That's also on Saturday. And I believe Houston's opening night is next weekend as well. So we kind of got some decisions to make here. It just kind of all depends on what weather does. If it looks really nice for next weekend, maybe we send it and go racing. Um, you know, go two nights in a row, make up for some track time that uh, was lost over the last couple of weeks. But uh, if not, I don't know, we'll see. But uh, for the time being, we'll kind of get to work here and get everything ready to go. Another wonderful addition to the scene residence. Nice golf cart. Get this running for Kathy. Beautiful. Side of the truck. Cool. Got her out. Months later, she's out of that uh, bush. Getting a little bit of rain on her right now. We're gonna check the air pressures and everything, but I think I talked about this in the original video when we got this, but nice. So there's where it came out of. There's where we had it. Trying to take it all the way around. Just to make sure we're facing the right direction. And I don't even have to deal with the hassle. 28 foot of trailer. Kind of the backyard. We got a couple other stickers added on. Um, got the My Mac Life Racing sticker on there. If you're a big karting fan, go check out his channel. He was somebody that I was watching last year when I was doing a bunch of kart racing. Um, he, uh, he's racing out there in North Carolina. He's also got a state farm agency, so we're pretty much homies, man. We got everything in common here. but. The other addition um, is the F Cancer uh, sticker on there for Dalen Cody. Happy to have this on the car. Happy to support Dalen. He's a great person. Um, I feel bad for the fact that, that even has to happen to somebody like that, but the Lord is gonna help him and obviously he's doing so right now. So a couple cool additions, um, but the car is pretty much ready to go. I mean, it's all uh, wrapped and everything's on there and we changed oil in it. It's got the race oil in it now, so. We're pretty much ready to go. Pretty much what it comes down to now is weather. I mean, as I've talked about in like the last three videos, we're just getting destroyed up here in the upper Midwest when it comes to uh, weather. It's been cold, it's been windy, it's been rainy. It's been like 40 degrees for a high uh, most of the days. And then the nights will get like 28 degrees for a low, which doesn't help race tracks at all. According to the Farmer's Almanac up here, like you're finding like 38 degrees, 40 degrees, about eight inches deep in the ground. So it's still pretty cold. But uh, apparently next week, the, uh, the weather's going to break now officially. So we should see this thing on the track next week. Like I said at the beginning of the video, we kind of have a little bit of a decision to make here when it comes to where we're going to race next weekend. Cedar Lake Open Wheel Spectacular, Arlington Test and Tune, and Houston's Opener. So going to be a kind of a question to ask ourselves here up over the next couple of days as to what we want to do. Maybe you guys can comment down in the, uh, the comments section below. Let us know where we should go, where you think we should go. Um, and then maybe we'll make a decision based off of that. But uh, obviously I have my personal, you know, perfect world. I'd love to go to Cedar and then Houston's and just go race two nights in a row, but that might not be realistic. Uh, maybe we'll just get out to one and then, you know, move from there. But uh, obviously I'm itching. I want to get seat time. Uh, I want to get this thing moving. I want to get this thing figured out. You know, as a rookie, I got a ton to learn. You know, I got a lot of, a lot, a lot of mistakes to make. That's for sure. I'd like to start making them now just so we can get those bugs out of our system. I can't wait, man. I can't wait. It's been the longest nine months of my entire life. 
Um, I've never felt like I've had to wait for something this long. I feel like it's been years since I bought the car. So we'll hopefully see what happens next weekend. Outside of that, we're ready to go. So Mother Nature's just gotta help us out. Also wanna give a quick shout out here to Max and Grant. Uh, they've been watching the videos. Uh, they just called <laughs> called Steve here and uh, they were watching a Forge and Dirt video while, uh, while doing that. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I appreciate you guys watching. Well, hopefully the next time you see us, um, this thing will be being loaded up into a trailer and we'll be heading to a racetrack. But until then, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. If you got to the end of the video, make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. It helps me a ton. I appreciate you. Have a good week. Yeah, yeah, yeah.